Hi everyone! Welcome back to Anikapedia with me, Anika. And today I am so excited because we're going to be learning all about the continents. So what are we waiting for? Let's go! What is a continent? A continent is one of Earth's seven main divisions of land. Before the continents were formed, they were all combined together as one massive supercontinent called Pangaea. Pangaea was surrounded by a single ocean called Pantlassa. Pangaea began to break up. Scientists believe that Pangaea broke apart for the same reason that plates are moving today. Plates? What are they? Let's start with the layers of Earth to understand it better. The Earth is composed of four different layers. Many geologists believe as the Earth cooled the heavier, denser materials sank to the center and the lighter materials rose to the top. Because of this, the crust is made of the lightest materials, like rock, and the core consists of heavy metals, like nickel and iron. So, you can say that the crust is the solid, rocky outer shell of the planet. The Earth's crust is broken into separate pieces, called tectonic plates. Plates are like pieces of land that connect together on the Earth's outer shell. You can think of them like a giant round puzzle that cover the Earth underneath the ground. The movement caused by convection currents that roll over the upper zone of the mantle. Convection current? What does that even mean? Geologists have hypothesized that the movement of tectonic plates is related to convection currents in the Earth's mantle. Convection currents describe the rising spread and sinking of gas, liquid, or molten material caused by the application of heat. Inside a beaker, hot water rises at the point where heat is applied. The hot water moves to the surface, then spreads out and cools. Cooler water sinks to the bottom. Due to all of these movements in the tectonic plates, Pangaea broke up into the seven continents. Here, I'll name them for you. North America, South America, Africa, Europe, Asia, Australia, and finally, Antarctica. Let's learn some fun facts about the continents with me. Let's get on with it. Pangaea is thought to be formed as a result of collision between two large continents, Laurasia and Gondwana. Laurasia included North America, Europe, and Asia. Gondwana included the present-day South America, Africa, Antarctica, and the Arabian Peninsula and the Indian subcontinent. German geophysicist and polar researcher Alfred Wegener proposed the theory of the continental drift in which he explains how the continents broke off from a single supercontinent and drifted away. On the basis of the supercontinent cycle, it is estimated that plate movements will form a new supercontinent in about 250 million years in the future. Scientists have already made a map detecting how it, the future supercontinent will look like during that period. It's pretty interesting. It was so cool to learn about how the continents were formed. We will be going to each continent one by one in my future videos. So stay tuned and like and subscribe to my channel so you don't miss out the fun. Goodbye!